half a million, we don't have to pay in, in just one shot. And they give us one year for paying the money. So, it's more or less the same. And there are strong, strong uh, change in the system, in the whole system. Is uh, we, we cannot use task force, so we cannot go together with other members of the industry. Each active ingredient has to be one dossier. So, uh, five active ingredients, I'm sorry, five dossiers, and the cost of, of this. Well, our experience is a good one. We, we reach to the market. We start something like 15 years ago making the definition of the product, probably in the bench. Then we make all the regulatory. We identify the production. We get the register, the active ingredient, the national ones. And we consider that history as a, as a good history. At the end of the day, uh, we have to make an agreement with a distribution company, a strong distribution company, right? In order to get to the market. If you think it's impossible to get to the market if you have if you have just one product, you have no the possibility of, of doing people in the street trying to sell the product if you if you just have one product. For me the, the, the much more important point are three points. The first one is very located here. Uh, the, the, the product has to be a good product. If you make the whole process but the product is not, work, it's not working, it's nothing, right? So the first thing is the bench, the laboratory, the design of the product, and all that kind of things. In that point, it's very important too to know what is thinking the market and how the market is dealing with that kind of products. And the problem is that normally you have to think about the market in five or seven years old, very late. And that's a little bit complicated. The second point is the regulation. If you think that you have a good product and you want to be with a big company to make a distribution agreement, the big company want uh, safety. They want to have all the papers legally. So you have to make all the regulatory papers, let's say the European uh, authorization for the active, ing uh, active ingredients, the national uh, authorization for the product, <coughs> and so on. And the regulatory are probably the second much more important thing, right? And the third thing is reach to the market. A good product with good, good regulatory without selling is very difficult. Right? So, the third point is how to deal with the, let's say, industry uh, and make a good distribution agreement in order to uh, go into the market. Normally, small companies who has uh, research and development get to the uh, authorization to the uh, active ingredients. But we cannot get to the different countries to get the national accreditation, the national registration. <coughs> For that, you, normally you, you make an agreement with a distribution company. And that, is, that point is very, very important because at the end of the day, probably the property of the national accreditation is combined between you and the other company. But the three points are important. The three points uh, can make you reach to the market. We have made it in 15 years, and we we still are small, and we still without the intervention of any other big company, right? So if, if we can do it, anyone can do it, right? And well, that's all. Thank you very much. Thank you.